What do you do? What do you do, baby? What do you do, baby? How you guys doing? Welcome back to my channel. Okay, I need to stop. This way or this way? Or this way? Comment down below and let me know what you think. Wait, actually, before we even go anywhere, subscribe to my channel. You know the content is fire. You know you look forward to my videos. Subscribe. Subscribe. Okay, I'm done. This is not me. I'm a sweet girl. I'm not aggressive at all. Okay, cool. On today's episode of Tabang has a YouTube channel, I thought I would give you an insight into ordering bikinis on AliExpress. Ugh, I need a. Uh, uh. I recently traveled to Thailand and it was the best trip ever honestly I think I actually left my heart in Thailand like it was amazing and before going to Thailand I ordered a couple of bikinis because I was going to live my best life okay literally I was like foreign country foreign land nobody knows you and you're just gonna live your best life on a side note I am a plus size woman, I'm not a size zero, I am a little thick, I am a little insecure about parts of my body like my stomach and my thighs uh, and my arms, okay the list is really long but <laughs> the biggest problem for me is my stomach, like I got a gut cause I like to eat, you know what I mean, like you know I got a gut, a big one, like sometimes I look down and I'm just like I could pass for three months pregnant but it's okay god is good he is still on the throne jesus reigns god he reigns holy is the lamb it's all good jesus is dealing with my eating issues because i eat a lot but that wasn't gonna stop me actually funny story my friend and i started exercising in january months before the trip i didn't lose anything i gave up like two months before the trip i was like i'm done like I was determined, okay, I was determined to lose the little meat, the little love handles, but it didn't happen. But that is not the point of today's video. The point of the the, the point of today's video is to show you guys the bikinis that I bought. It was my first time ever, not first time ever in a bikini, but like I try to stay away from bikinis because of my body type. And yeah, it's great that also like nowadays like there's options for, you know, bigger women or she was the socially acceptable word but like plus size you know there's a range nowadays for plus size like size zero up until whatever so it feels good to like be included in those sizes and representation on social media for us with big stomachs and you know if my stomach was small meh, my butt would be big girl because of the illusion you know what I'm gonna stop talking but anyway uh, before going on the trip like around January I started looking around seeing what to buy what sites to buy from I mean we went in store and I just feel like the prices were too high like bikinis were going for like 300 rand and I'm just like I know Aliexpress has got my back like I rely so much on Aliexpress whenever I want like a cheaper alternative and that's what we did but I was more interested in Zaffle because I've heard greater reviews on Zaffo. Um, apparently the stuff arrives within like two weeks and etc. So what happened was we scouted on Zaffo. Prices were around $15, which is like 200 and something rand. And then um, just as we were about to place our order, the price all of a sudden increased by like seven dollars and i remember being so pissed that i actually inboxed that for i'm like dude when i was looking at this bikini a week ago and took a screenshot um this is how much it cost and now two weeks later when i'm trying when i'm finally like i'm purchasing this is my first time purchasing on zaffo I w i'm going in for the kill all of a sudden you increase your prices by like seven dollars and i was livid and i just ended up dropping it because i felt like now it is it it was similar to me going in store and just purchasing something in store and then i went back to aliexpress and aliexpress keeps getting my coins so i placed two orders um the first order i placed was on the 9th of february because i know aliexpress takes long i've done a video on my brushes ordering brushes on aliexpress and aliexpress takes like three months to deliver your product so i knew i had to order in january so february 9th i placed my order of bikinis after scrolling through and collected my items two months later now when i collected my items 
the reason for placing a second order is because when I collected my items, I was like, damn, there's nothing like bright. Like it was all dull. I felt like, oh my goodness, like I was so boring and I'm going for the trip of a lifetime. Let me order like bright colors and whatever. So I then placed the second order with like colorful, more colorful items. And yeah, but essentially I have like around five um, bikini sets. Let me show them to you guys and then talk about the good. And then we'll talk about I've already spoken about the bad being Zaffle and the prices and then the ugly will be towards the end. The first, very first bikini I have is this white one over here. Okay, so what happened was um, AliExpress delivered these bikinis in individual packages and I collected them at the at the post office for like 25 rand or 26 rand. Yeah, so you pay the, this bikini was like eight dollars which is roughly around 121 rand and it came in a packet obviously and bubble wrapped not bubble wrap but like so there's like a plastic covering and then the postal like covering with all your details and then this is inside and some of the packages unfortunately i don't have those packages because like i mean i already have the bikinis i've worn them throw away the packages but like some of the packages included these like little mini gifts and i don't know what to use this for like what is this like is it a hairband like i don't i don't know what to do with this thing so i'm just like whatever this is the first bikini that i bought oh my goodness i feel so shy because this is like it looks huge okay insecurities aside whatever this is the bikini bottom <laughs> spongebob square pants and as you can see it really goes up the crack like let's be honest it like goes up the crack this was probably my least favorite one because on the picture it looked really awesome but like the model obviously but then like when i put it on i didn't look snatched i didn't have the body for it so it was a good bikini the quality is really good this is the um top uh, I don't know if you can see like the little breast pads over there. The quality is really good. Like this is some thick quality over here. And then the buckles are really nice. And yeah, like I would actually just wear this as a boob tube, like going out with some friends. This was a large. I should have probably gone a size down, I think. Um, I always place a large size because AliExpress size I haven't actually quite figured it out. So I just place like large and then the next one oh this one took me by surprise because for me this was like a legit bikini and like for somebody like me i never thought i'd wear this but um this was in my first order it's this bra top and it's a large but it's so tight oh my goodness and the straps are super thin um gosh am i even doing this really well like how do influencers do this but um this is it and then this is the bottom i prefer high-waisted bikinis because like i told you guys i have a little bit of a pouch it did expose my pouch a lot um but it, and it was really tight this was probably the tightest of them all but like yeah and this is i like how it covered my butt as well it covered really well and like on my skin tone it, it was really nice and also like a thick material like this these are not gonna rip like these are proper material um yeah what i find interesting is that i don't know much about bikinis <sighs> okay i need to take a break as i was saying i don't know much about bikinis but i find that they have like these little holes in here for you to take out the little um pads like breast pads if you're a regular bikini wearer like you all know these things i'm not and like yeah i just i didn't know that that was a thing so that was also eight dollars by the way so around 121 rand and then the third one that i bought on the 9th of feb was this boob tube um bikini and oh this like on my skin tone was fire this maroon color was fire but as you can see like i felt like the maroon was dull i thought it was gonna be like bright red um and this is the high-waisted um high-waisted bottom this goes up the butt like this is just like it up the butt uh if you're conservative uh just get something else <laughs> but like I want to see you naked, naked, naked. 
for me this is a lot for me personally i know there are other people out there who like mm, this isn't a big deal for them but for me it was a little bit of a big deal and yeah this is the bottom which looks massive but in the pictures i look snatched so gorgeous amazing um material very thick two linings like the one in here and the one in, here, in the inner and then you can also take out this thing so it says 85 percent polyester 15 percent spandex i've washed these by the way um and they wash really well like they haven't like fallen apart even the pads inside like they haven't fallen apart so i loved these so so much this one was ten dollars they all oh, all these prices i'm talking about include the standard shipping which takes forever i know there's usually like three shipping methods i always choose the cheapest and then the other bikini that i bought was the black one over here this was also my least favorite on the model obviously it looked gorgeous on me it was just fine I don't think I have it was just plain and a little bit boring like I would rather wear this on a night out with friends and whatever the front is boring however the back darling like these are gorgeous the detailing but I don't know maybe because it's black I feel like if it was on a different color it would have provided that pop but because it was black it was just, eh, it was okay I hope you guys can see like maybe I'm too close there is the bikini Top. It was too much material for me and maybe grandma -ly for my look for that I was going for $10 which is like 151 rand. On to the next one. The next one is this over here. Also like boob tube. I just love the pattern on this one. I wanted something different. This one has wires on the end. So because it was a little bit tight, a little bit uncomfortable, but not too bad. Like not too bad. This was a large as well. Same material. It's almost like I bought from the same shop, but honestly, I didn't. Oh, and the bottoms for this one were black. In the back. <laughs> okay, cool. That was $13. So this piece over here was $13 which is like $1.97 so after all these bikinis arrived I felt like oh my goodness you know when I was ordering this it was around the season when neon was popping I was like oh my goodness I need neon I need like bright stuff and all these are like dull you know what I mean like they're just everyday colors and I was just like come on spice up your life you're having a trip your first ever friendcation or whatever vacation with so I placed the second order on the 26th of April so this was like a week after collecting these other bikinis I bought this next bikini when I tell you this bikini took my trip from here okay <laughs> But honestly, this next bikini, like, it complements my body so well. It just hugs my figure really well. It exposes the bomb bombs. It's just, it's, it makes me voluptuous. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is my favorite bikini of the entire bikini haul. And I just love it so much. This is it. Like, I don't know if you can see. Let me pull it back. But this is like my favorite bikini. The color is so gorgeous. And what I love about this bikini is the, the fact that like this midsection, it like exposes my, like the top half of my stomach. And then the bottoms um, over here, the bottom over here. So this part over here like hides my stomach really well. My little pouch, which I don't like that much, which needs to go. Um, and then it's as you can see like it just turns into a thong. Let's be honest like this part was a swallowed by my butt <laughs> And I was rocking it confidently the cutouts these little things they just did something for my figure This was $11 which is around about 166 Rand and it was totally worth it I wore it when we went to PP Island and it was just like amazing like really amazing it just it's a, your butt's out so i had to keep checking my my hoo-ha to s make sure it was covered also because you know she's thick 
oh, ha, 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 must be covered, you know? So I had to keep glancing to make sure she was also not exposed. The front don't need to be exposed, just the back. Eh, if we can see it from the front, then can sing it around the back, 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 back. Keep it juicy, juicy. Oh, yeah, let me play my song. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So unnecessary. But yes, um, had this song come out when had this song come out in Thailand, I would have posted wearing this bikini. Hey. I keep it juicy, juicy. I eat a lot. Let me move on. And then the last bikini cover up actually that I want to show you is this one over here. This was eight dollars, hundred and twenty-one rand. And I don't know if you can see. I only got to wear this once, and when you first look at it, you're like cheap looking, whatever. But when I put it on, like it really serves. It serves. It was bordering on a little bit too much. I wish it was longer. I think it was just like a little bit too short, so it made me look a little bit like a hooker. But this is not all that I ordered. The other stuff that I ordered did not arrive. <laughs> That's the ugly. So I ordered like four items, two of the same items, because I was ordering for me and the friend. I've always maintained that when you order on AliExpress, they give you like 90 days or 60 days protection order. They call it a protection order. And this is where like your order is protected for those 60 or 90 days. You can possibly get a refund. You're not guaranteed a refund. So I tried to get a refund after the protection order had ended. Literally tried to get a refund like two days ago over the weekend. And I would let you guys know if I got a refund or not. I doubt I got a refund. It's October now. If you want those December clothes, order them now. Or else they'll arrive like in Jan and by that time it's over and you know Dragon City Avalane and counterfeit goods small street the police what are we gonna wear guys in December <laughs> since they're reading small street and Dragon City like Johannesburg like oh, what are we gonna wear I'm actually one of those people who's concerned because I got clothes from small street I shop cheap I shop alternative, I save my coin because of that black tax, hey? It's not because of Chase, the black tax. Final thoughts, I was pretty happy with what I ordered. Seven out of 11 items arrived. In fact, I've got a trip in December and I ordered some stuff off AliExpress at 3 a.m. in the morning. I'm broke, but I'm still ordering. It's okay, like you only live once, like fashion kills depression. No, it doesn't. <laughs> I'm kidding. That was totally wrong of me to say nothing kills depression. Um, just go to your doctor, talk to people, etc. Um, don't get depression advice from me, please. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, subscribe to my channel, like, like this video, subscribe to my channel. Criticize me if you want to. What do you want to see? Like, we are family. Call your brother, sister, and tell them to subscribe. Okay, subscribe to my channel and ring the bell to be notified every time I upload. And leave a comment, like my videos, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.